anything happen. So to be honest, I don't expect this to taste very good. This is the one I'm gonna surprise mom with. Ooh, what is this? Hi everyone, first and foremost, I wanna wish you all a very happy holidays. I hope you guys are gonna be eating a lot, eating really good food, you know, drinking some boba. And after watching this video, maybe you'll have a new recipe to try for boba. And today is actually the last episode of Vlogmas. I know, really, really sad. But if you guys enjoyed any of the Vlogmas videos, it would really mean a lot to me if you could hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell, as well as give this video a thumbs up. Because it was a lot of work, I literally haven't gotten sleep since the beginning of December. So it would really help me out a lot and I really appreciate your support. So anyway, enough talking, let's get started. Okay, so today we are making hot chocolate bombs, which is a trend I've been seeing all around the internet, but more specifically TikTok, and it has really blown up this past month. So basically, if you don't know, the hot chocolate bombs are like circular chocolate balls but inside they fill it with like marshmallows and hot cocoa mix and sprinkles, etc., etc. But whenever I would see those, I would think I wonder what would happen if I tried to put boba in there. So today we're gonna go ahead and try that. Uh, honestly, I don't know how it's gonna go. I'm like a little worried. <laughs> I feel like a lot of things could go wrong, not only in the making process, but what if in the end it doesn't taste good? I don't know, but we'll see. And let's go ahead and get into it. <laughs> so here I have my mold and I already went ahead and melted some chocolate. So I have a green one, which is just white chocolate that I melted and then I mixed some matcha powder into it. And then the red one is red candy melts. So I'm kind of nervous how this is gonna turn out, but let's just try it. I'm gonna go ahead and scoop some of my matcha white chocolate in there. Let's see, I don't know exactly how much to put. You have to get a good layer all around and make sure there's no holes or else there's gonna be holes in your chocolate bomb. Should I have bought something to spread this better? <laughs> um, doesn't really look that great, but I think that's as good as this is gonna get. So I'm gonna try doing the red one. I think since the red one is candy melts, it will go on easier, I hope. <laughs> Cause yeah, the white chocolate one was kind of a struggle. All the TikToks make this look so easy, but <laughs> it's actually a lot harder than it looks. Okay, I finally finished. These don't look super great, but now we're gonna stick them in the fridge for a little bit to let them harden. Okay, so I just took these out of the fridge and they don't look the greatest, but we're gonna take them out of these molds and hope for the best. So let's try this red one. Whoa. Oh, actually it didn't turn out that bad. Some of the edges are kind of messed up like right there, but like the overall thing kind of worked. I'm actually really surprised, but pleasantly surprised. Ooh, look at that perfect dome shape, nice and shiny. It looks like an ornament. Wow, dude, I'm so pro. <laughs> look at this, it looks so nice. All right, let's look at these green ones. Oh my gosh, I hope they turned out okay. Uh, <laughs> it's kind of messed up. It has this like marbling, I guess, cause I didn't mix the white chocolate and the matcha well enough probably, but it actually does look kind of pretty. I don't know if I'm just lying to myself to make myself feel better, but I think it looks actually kind of nice. <laughs> Oh no, this one kind of has a hole in it, but overall, not too bad. So I'm gonna bring my little chocolate bombs over and I have this huge bowl of boba. If you wanna know how I make my instant boba at home, check out the link in the cards. But yeah, so now we're gonna add the boba to the <laughs> chocolate bombs. I'm honestly not sure how this is gonna go, but I guess let's just go ahead and do it. I wanna add a lot of boba though. Oh my gosh, this is so interesting. So I'm gonna bring this little one over to the stove and try to seal it. I'm gonna take the top half and I have a hot pan here. Hopefully it's not too hot, I don't know. And then we're gonna put it on top and get it to melt a little bit. Oh, 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 it's already melting. And then we put it on top of the chocolate ball. Oh no. Okay, melt, melt together, please. I don't know, it didn't really work. Let me try to melt it a little more. Okay, and then immediately put it on top. Come on, melt together, please. You're my only hope. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, it doesn't look horrible, but it's definitely not completely sealed together correctly. But good thing we have two more tries. This is boba ball number two. It's pretty filled with boba there. So let's take the top, try to melt it a little bit. Ooh, it's melting pretty good. Okay, 
put it on top. Ooh, this one probably is better, I think. I don't know, I hope. I think this one actually did do better than the last one, but it definitely isn't completely sealed properly. <laughs> All right, last but not least, we have the matcha one. <laughs> Let's hope for the best. Melt, melt, melt. Put it on top. Come on, seal, seal. Ooh. Yeah, some of this. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, oh, okay. This one was looking kind of good, but now it's kind of messed up. I don't know. Ah! <laughs> I think we've learned today that chocolate bombs are not my strong suit, but let's go put some hot milk over these chocolate bombs and hope that it works. <laughs> All right, so I have my hot milk here. I'm gonna go ahead and put this bomb in my glass. I wanna place it carefully. It's very fragile. And now we pour the hot milk. Come on, come on, please. Did anything happen? <laughs> okay, so far we can't really see anything. Let's see. Oh, oh, do you guys see the boba on the bottom? Ooh, this looks so Christmassy. Wow, ooh, ooh, ooh. And we'll have a little extra touch of Christmas. We're gonna put some peppermint on there. Oh, it kind of splattered everywhere. <laughs> that was not as graceful as I imagined, but wow, look at that. Oh no, I'm spilling. Oh my gosh, I'm just a hot mess today. <laughs> so to be honest, I don't expect this to taste very good. It's more about the experience, you know, but of course we're gonna go ahead and taste it. Oh, the milk is so hot. <laughs> Wait, but it's actually kind of good. <laughs> it basically kind of tastes like hot chocolate with boba and a sprinkle of peppermint, which is actually not that bad. I'm like impressed. Mmm. <laughs> mm. Boba and hot drinks is actually really good too because it keeps the boba nice and warm and chewy and soft. Mmm. I'm a fan. This is actually such a nice Christmassy drink. Like I'm totally ready to eat my Christmas hot pot dinner now. <laughs> okay, so I realized that in the last chocolate bomb, I didn't decorate it, which I bought a few things specifically so I could decorate the chocolate bombs. So I bought these little edible decorations from Target and I'm gonna put a few of them on top of the chocolate bombs. And I also put some of my red candy melts in a bag so that way I could drizzle it onto the green one and get some nice contrast. Ooh, ooh, that looks really nice. Ooh, oh, oh my gosh. Ah, that's so pretty. And then I'm gonna put a little bit on top of this red one so that way our little things have stuff to stick to. It's gonna be so cute. And then on this one, hmm, what should I put? I'll put this cute little present on it as well. Yay, aren't they so cute? Oh my gosh. So I'm gonna wait for the decorations to harden and then I'm gonna surprise mom with a little chocolate bomb and we're gonna see her reaction. Okay, so I got my little bombs here and they turned out so cute. Look at this one. This is the one I'm gonna surprise mom with. So let me call her over. Oh, what is this? It's like a trend right now. It's called a hot chocolate bomb. So this thing is made of chocolate and usually they put hot chocolate mix in there and marshmallows and stuff. But this one, I, I made it different. It's special. Wow, it's so cute and yeah. fancy. <laughs> yeah, I put little um, presents on top. How do we eat this? Okay, so uh, what we do is we put it in this cup let me try and get it in there nicely. Okay, and then I have hot milk here, mm. and then we're gonna pour it on top, okay? Ooh, and I wonder what's gonna happen to it. Ooh, ooh, <laughs> whoa! <laughs> so it melted and something's inside there, so why don't you give it a mix? Oh. Can you see what's whoa. in there? Oh! <laughs> oh my gosh, I, I see boba! Yeah! <laughs> oh, nice! Okay. Ooh. You can mix it and give it a try. It's gonna be hot though, be careful. Mm. Is it good? Very good! Wait, actually, wow. I, I forgot to put some uh, peppermints in there. That oh, adds a nice flavor. That's, oh, that's even better. Mm. God, I, I love peppermint. Mm. It's this spot. It's mm. pretty good, right? Very good! It's kind of like hot chocolate with um, boba <laughs> and peppermint. Have you tried it? Yeah, I tried one before, but it wasn't as pretty as the one that I made you. Oh, this is really good. I'm gonna finish this. Mm. 
All right, so that's it for this video. And this wraps up Vlogmas. I can't believe it's over. Uh, I'm gonna take a very much needed break because I have not been getting any sleep. But I just wanted to say that I'm really appreciative of all of you guys out there watching. It means literally the world to me. Um, I don't want to get emotional, <laughs> but I also wanted to say happy holidays to you guys. I hope you're doing well and staying safe out there. And if you like this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell so you get notified when I upload. Give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! This is so good! <laughs> you actually like it, Mom?